everybody I wanted to go back and take a look at this Bitcoin chart and video that I made um, so this was back April 12th I said Bitcoin bull run begins summer of 2022 and I know this looks like some school but this was actually some pretty decent um, analysis with kind of a breakdown of when I believe the chen the trend change was going to take place so if we just kind of go back to let me see it was right here trend potential trend break which will in essence turn into the bull the bull run the beginning of the bull run so my analysis puts us at the beginning of the bull run starting on May 31st with the first breakout on around June 19th. So essentially the first. All right. So we still have some time around this um, for this to really happen. It's still not 31st. You know, that's next week. Uh, so what? It initially made me start this well on crypto.com uh, BTC is currently at 30,255 uh, 2,256 okay it's going up it's breaking now when we go back and so let's just take a look at the Bitcoin chart uh, not this chart here we go okay so when we're gonna take a look at this chart okay so our get out of here fib, fib. okay so our we just got the bull indicator okay um, but essentially this is just on the one hour right now and as you can see this bull you know this is for short time trade and we had a bear so what I'm looking for is actually a break over this bearish signal from previously, which is a, um, a high of 30,221. Now, according to crypto.com, we have already broken out over those levels. And so this next level here with the complete high at 30,494, it's really what I'm looking at. Okay, we have a lot of resistance here. At that at 30,342 it looks like let's see how much volume we have here uh, so on the volume profile is showing me okay so we have a decent amount of volume here It was a total of 250, 258. Okay, so right now, according to Trade and View, we haven't really reached those levels yet. We're just sitting at like, um, we haven't really broken out yet. Now, if I go into five minute, okay, we've broken. We, it's a little bit more. We're approaching that line, okay, kind of consolidating right here. I see a nice volume spike, all right. I like this volume spike, but it's decreasing. But there are there's some buying going on right now, something's happening, okay. So this is the trade in view chart. Let's go see what other so let's go and crack in for a second. Crack in yet yeah, these prices aren't up to date yet. They're not ready. Um let's go to token metrics. Let's see my price. I don't think token metrics is ready either. What's going on? Oh, did it um, log me out? Oh no. Alright, 
So, but token metrics right now actually doesn't. All right, it's on the daily. That's why. Okay, it's using the daily chart over here. Okay, that's why. So, the BTC USD pair right now on Crypto.com is thirty thousand two hundred ninety-four. Wow. So we've already broken. Out. Actually, you know what? Fuck it. Let's go to. Let's go to. Can, Making some charts. Oh, that's right. I'm not going to be able to. Can I? All right. Yeah. Here we go. I don't know why I didn't just go here in the first place, actually. So let's take a look at the price here on crypto.com. All right. So I don't know if this is the most accurate and looks like it is. I'm fucking trading it. So, um,. It seems to be ahead of the market, or at least ahead of other exchanges. But right now, we have broken out over this trade in view. Interesting. It's still not showing it, but it's showing it up here. Oh, duh. But it's still not showing it. It's still going to show the uh, full uh, to 271. Is it trying to pump it? Anyway, I do like the increase in volume here. Is it? <laughs> I know what they do. It's uh, whatever. Anyway, so let's go back to my video. All right, let's go back to that video and see what I finished saying. Finish what was I saying? Third week in June. Okay, so that puts us at retesting, um, retesting fifty one, fifty thousand, fifty one thousand around the third week of June. Once we retest, all right, people are going to want to take some profits, okay? This is going to be the first time we hit that level. And if, the, if we have continuation in volume, okay, um, and but our volume only, so say we get to the third week of June and our volume is around the, um, so, yeah, you can go and watch that video if you want the rest of the details about that. Now, look, I don't think this is going to happen. The market right now is really, really going through a lot at this moment. If it pushes through and breaks out, this would be, some, it, hey, it would be great news. Um, and it would be a nice analysis on my part. Uh, like I said, it needs to follow through with increase in volume. So I do like this volume coming in that I see but at the same time I want to see a nice clean breakout all right and not just a little fake out breakout but I want to see it like so in my analysis what I was getting at okay um, this was this was basically supporting at that 39 all right so on this we're actually down here we are below okay um, and we're, we're sitting at that 30,000 mark. Let's see. So where's that 30,000 mark? That's about, this is 32. So we're around here. Okay. So we're around that, that previous support levels. Um, matter of fact, let's pull up the, uh, the entire chart. So. All right, so that's putting us all 
all right because we didn't get the signal yet okay on the daily obviously because this is still just happening all right so our biggest volume all right so we really gonna want to break out above this 33 okay this 33,000 level right here all right has really high as volume. it's actually the highest volume level okay so that is what I'm looking really we got to break above that if we break above that with increasing volume and we have a new ch trend change and then we can really go to the previous level of what I was talking about at that 51 52,000 uh, but it may not be that 52 It'll probably be more like um, you know more like right uh, at this 48 oh, about that 48,000 mark or so that's what I see essentially so this would be like the updated version with the new price of what I see happening now okay so we're talking about continuation like this and then that nice cup of handle all right and then so you know this is and now I'll put us around there oh yeah. so that's that's kind of like how I'm see I know <laughs> you guys are probably like this guy's just scribbling and shit um, no, but really, let me see if I can explain a little bit what I'm, it's just, first of all, this is just a, a guesstimation off of just levels. That's all it is. Off of levels utilizing, um, the volume profile and previous, uh, support and resistance. So essentially we're going to get some consolidation here. Okay. I'd like a nice little, um, a break above the trend change. To get to that 32,000 level, we're probably gonna pull back. The shorts are gonna come in heavy, thinking, you know, and then next thing you know, we're gonna see an increase in volume, and then that's just gonna give us a nice little lift off. And that's when we're gonna really, we're gonna retest previous resistance, all right? And um, actually, let's see if I can get the time frame. Um, let me see. So essentially, from here to here. Okay, that's 146 days. They say like the breakouts around should be 600 days, but actually I shouldn't be doing it from right here though. I actually should be doing it from here. Um, so. All right, about 458 day before we retest, potentially. I mean, figure this this um, this was a week, but figure by the time this was um, 189 days, 192 days. Okay, so let's take that. We can take that and probably go from here. All right. Um, you can see my analysis not that far off from what I was thinking all right you know so hey you never know what could happen this is this is just all you know uh, fun for me so we'll see what happens remember it's not financial advice it's just for educational entertainment purposes only 
uh, do your own due diligence and never invest and trade money that you can't afford to lose. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like videos like this, if you want me to talk more about analysis um, and share my uh, thoughts pertaining to this, let me know. Leave a comment, leave a like, and will I come out right? Remember, this was back in April 12th of this year, I said the Bitcoin bull run begins summer 2022. So what does that mean? That means we're not breaking out this summer to, to all new highs, that which would be awesome. But what does that mean? That means the trend change is going to happen this summer. So it's going to break us out of this bearish cycle that started back in November of 2021. And we're going to start to see um, higher lows and a retest of previous resistance. All right, if you like this video, appreciate it, appreciate you. I'm trying to get to 5,000 subscribers, help me get to 5,000 subscribers. I'm gonna do some giveaways. Once we hit 1,000 subscribers, we're gonna do a giveaway, some Bitcoin, and um, I can't wait to let you guys know the fantastic news, but I can't tell you just yet, so stay tuned, continue watching, continue supporting. Leave a comment below, you know, help me out for that YouTube algorithm. Subscribe, share with your friends, family, let people know about cryptology and the Davatar community. Catch you on the next one. Peace.